I would like to compliment Mr. Rajiv Sandra and his team for doing a wonderful job of bringing more than 10,000 alumni when it grows. They have taken full advantage of the Facebook, email, digital world, and now and more than 10,000 alumni are able to interact with each other. It is going to be a lot of benefit to young engineers and satisfaction to senior engineers. I have been called to share with you my industrial experience. And before I start that, I would like to share what my boss when I joined the job shared with you. He told engineers and business managers, they can develop anything, they can do miraculous job. They can go to any place, but only place they are not doing human entry is health. And it's like this, sometimes some engineers must tend to help. There are no air conditioners, they have started developing air conditioners. They have developed luxury cars, they have developed luxury homes, luxury offices. And once, God, during Hebrew, he asked regions, how is health? He said, very fine, you don't like anything. We are improving like anything, and soon we are going to compete with heaven. What is that? What is this? I created health to be like health only. In future, don't allow any engineer to come to health. Let them go to health and let them go to health. <laughs> this is the power of engineers. This is the power of business managers. What we cannot think, we can do. We engineers. This is the power. Within 15 to 20 years, I foresee most of you will be becoming CEOs, president, director, managing director of various strategic organizations. Some of you may ask, Mr. Kapoor, having come from Hyderabad, how you can think? You don't know us. It's very simple. When you go and buy a BMW, an Audi or a Mercedes, you need not drive the car to see the performance. When you buy a car, you know it has come from a reputed organization and it is going to perform excellent. Same with the condition of Thapa. to become a better professional, better manager, and better leader. That all around knowledge, not only technical knowledge, is sufficient for you to reach to the top most position of the most reputed organization in the world. The first and foremost thing is to select a job of your choice. You should enjoy your job. It should not happen that uh, tomorrow again I have to go to the job. And up to five, I have to say it's so very and that is all. You select a job of your choice so that you enjoy it. This is the time when you can select it. Those who are good in design, they go, let them go to design and development. Those who are good in talking and convincing others, marketing is our option. And those who want to do physical work, they can go to the shop floor. But it should be to your choice. That is only going to give you more and more growth. 
when you enter in any organization, you are going to get three types of persons. First type is good people. A good boss will always help you. A good colleague will always help you. They will motivate you for your any of your achievement. They will protect you. For any of their mistakes, they will save time. But the second type of persons are cunning people. You are going to get them also. And you will not be able to find a difference between good and cunning people. They will be talking very good in front of you. But whenever they will get opportunity, they will try to steal your achievement and they will try to impose their behaviors on you. But they are not so harmful. You can live in a short period, you can legalize that. The third type of persons are the dangerous person. Unfortunately, in every organization there are some dangerous persons. I hope all of you must be knowing Hindi. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Have you heard Bhasma yes, sir. In every organization you will get few Bhasma Sutra. <laughs> and what will they say in the moment you will... First of all, your boss and police will watch you. Be, be careful from them. But even if they do not tell, he himself will come. Hello. Mr. Bex, he was working in our company. He used to always listen to me. Today he is the general manager of the company. <laughs> Mr. White has no, taken no decision without asking me. He is the first manager of the company. And Mr. Jack, he did not listen. Five days out. <laughs> so, you be careful from those muscles. You are going to an organization not to correct them. It is the duty of the management to correct them. You just make your career. And the moment you are established, they will then serve you. Further to grow, <coughs> listening is one more required. It is observed that 40% of the time managers spend in this way, whether it is a speech or police conversation or boss instruction or juniors problem. As per a survey, a person can speak around 160 words per minute, but your listening capacity is four times. You can concentrate only on 160 hertz. So try to concentrate on your listening, try to be a good listener. To grow further, you have to set your goals, make your targets, what you want to become after 5 years, what you want to become after 10 years and what you want to become. It's better if you write on a piece of paper, save it on your mobile or save it on your laptop. And every day when you are going for a job, maybe you may do some prayers in the morning. That time just see what are your targets and what is you are going to do today. And in the evening just spend 5 minutes to 10 minutes. Are you really progressing well for your targets? If not. Improve your speed. The next part is a time management. Everybody in the world is given 24 hours in a day. But it is only a time management. Few people are having sufficient time for the different activities. And people say, no, I am busy. 